Everybody always told me to pick 80 years, but I want to know what happens. Morning, Mom. Honey, why did you pick 10 hours? I don't want to lose you. You don't know for sure that's going to happen. I want to know. I'm going to school. Bye, Mom. Hi, Mr. Fitz. Giselle, you only have nine hours left. I just want to say it was a pleasure having you in my class. You were a great student. Uh, thank you. Oh, well, looks like somebody is dying tonight. How about you mind your own business for once, Jessica? At least I don't have to worry about bullying you anymore. Hey, um, do you know anything about the timer? You only have six hours left. You should have picked to the 80 like everybody told you to. What if I'm really gonna die? What if I'm really gonna die? Okay, here it goes. Three, two, one. Wait, I'm not dead? Hey mom, look, I didn't die. Yes, honey, but there's a three on your face. What do you mean there's a three on my face? Here, look. I wonder what that means. Whatever. I'm going to school. Good morning, Mr. Fitz. Oh my gosh, Giselle, you're not dead. And there's yeah, a... I know. There's a three on my face. I don't know what it means either. Okay then, just take a seat. Okay. Well, well, well. Look who's alive after all. Jessica, don't start. I actually want to apologize for bullying you. Here, please take this. Thank you. I don't feel so... Hey mom, my nose is bleeding. Could you please pass me a tissue? Here you go, honey. Thank you. Mom, my blood. It's blue. It's blue? Get out of my house. But mom, I... No but. You're one of them. Hey girl, my mom just kicked me out. Can I please come crash at your place? Yeah, sure. Come right over. Thanks. Thanks so much for letting me stay here. What's wrong with your nose? Oh, it's just a nosebleed. Let me see. You freak. Leave immediately. You better stay away from me. What's happening? I have to get to the bottom of this. Hey, doctor. What seems to be the problem? My blood is blue. Do you know what's happening to me? You have to come with me. You're a... Hey, doctor. And what seems to be the problem? My blood is blue. Do you know what's happening to me? We have to go. You're a... I'm a what? It's not safe here. I'll tell you somewhere else. Come with me. Where are we going? And why is it getting worse? Because you're transforming. Transforming into what? Look, it's a blue blood. What do we do? Run as fast as you can. Don't worry, you're safe here. Where are we? How could you bring her here? It's not safe. Don't worry, she's one of us. What exactly am I? You're immortal. Wait, I'm immortal? Don't worry, you're safe here. Where are we? How could you bring her here? It's not safe. Don't worry, she's one of us. What exactly am I? You're immortal. Wait, I'm immortal? Yes. How's that even possible? I'll explain later. Come with me. First things first, cover up all the blue with this. Why do I have to cover it up? Because if you don't, people will come looking for you. What happens if they find us? They'll kill us. Now go do as I say. I covered it up. Good. Now go out and pretend as if you know nothing. Excuse me, miss. We're looking for the blue bloods. Have you seen one? I'm sorry. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait. Your nose. Stay right where you are. Don't try to run. Time to see how much money my boyfriend has in his bank account. Not that that's important. I knew he had money, but not that much money. I'm going to pay him a little visit. Hey. Hey, handsome. I shouldn't tell him I know what's in his bank account. So, baby, what do you want for Christmas? Well, there is this Gucci bag that I really like, but you know what? What am I saying? You don't have to get me anything. Come on. Of course I'm getting you something. In fact, you might get that Gucci bag as long as you're not too naughty. I'll try. Right now, why don't you go out and buy yourself whatever you need? Okay. Bad news. What? Fluffy's sick. The vet says she needs surgery. Well, how much is it? It's about 
$2,000. We can't afford it. You know what? I think I got it covered. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, good. Babe, I'm- Whoa. Back. Listen, it's not what it looks like. We can't break up. I need his money. I can't break up with him. I need his money. Uh, her and I are just friends. Yeah, I'm gonna go now. Bye. Babe, I made a mistake. I'm sorry. It's okay. We all make mistakes. And it was my bad, really. I should have knocked before coming in. Thanks for understanding. She kind of made a mess. Do you think you can clean up? I gotta go to work. Of course, honey. All clean. And you just go make the money. Thanks, babe. Love you. Bye. He is so dead. I'm so happy Fluffy's okay, but how did you get the money to pay for her surgery? Mom, about that. There's something that I need to tell you. I can't believe he cheated on you. I know, but now that Fluffy's okay, I think I'm gonna go break up with him. What? Looks like he just got another paycheck. And you still have his credit card. Don't break up just yet. I have a plan for how you can get revenge. Hey, sweetie. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Who is she? You know, I was about to ask you the same thing, but you look really familiar. Are you a model or something? Uh, actually, yes. Figures. I'm sorry, babe, but this girl was just leaving. But you said, no, stay. I think you're going to want to see this. I actually got him a little something. Here you go, sweetheart. Thanks. Oh, wait, but first, before you open that, I believe this is mine, right? Uh-huh. That's your Gucci bag. That's the one you wanted, right? Yes, it is. Thank you. Okay, go ahead and open yours. All right. What's this? Receipts of things that I bought this week. Baby, 10k worth of stuff? Oh, baby, you and I both know that you can afford it. Oh, and there's a card in there, too. Go ahead and read that. Roses are red, violets are blue. You're a dirty, rotten cheater. I'm breaking up with you? Merry Christmas. <laughs> Girl, let's get out of here. I'm right behind you. Wait. Ladies, I'll buy you anything. No amount of money is worth being with him. Goodbye. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or...? Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good. Let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996? You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed? Now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because after I ate it, my head is filling. <sighs> my phone is dead and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. <gasps> yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm -hmm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> so step away from the girl. Let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. Babe, I got... Don't you dare use any more of those words. Understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm... What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you going to go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be $6.99 back on the card. Please help me. Hey, Mommy. Can I ride the bus to school with my friends? No, honey. I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom. Can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah. That's fine. Hey mom, there's 
this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry, you can't go. Okay. Hey, Mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. Hey, girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? I would love to, but I can. Ugh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at seven. I'll follow you into the park Through the jungle, through the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die Barefoot on a summer night Nothing new be sweeter than it with you And in the streets you're running free Like it's only you and me Jeez, you're something to see Oh, home Every come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, home Every come home Home is wherever I'm with you You can only say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment. Do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. You can only say no. No! Honey, do you want some breakfast? No! But it's your favorite, chocolate chip pancakes. No! Are you okay? Should I call a doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No. And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a date with prom yet? No. I heard Chad's gonna ask you. No! But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming! No, 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 no! Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No! Whatever, I'm out of here. No. Happy birthday. Hope you like your gift. Gummy bears. Really, guys? They're magic. Each one gives you a different ability. Okay, let's see what the red one does. Hey, check it out. Someone left five bucks on the street. Wait, don't go over there. That car came out of nowhere. How did you know that was going to happen? I, I don't know. I just did. Excuse me, Bria. Could I see you after class? Quite so. You want to see Mr. Peters? Yes, I have an assignment for you. And it's not on paper, if you know what I mean. Actually, I have to go. Mom, I think we need to report my... What is he doing? Your little brother is building a tower. With bricks? No, wait, I think he's gonna... What color should I choose today? Hmm, just kidding. I already picked it. Let's go with blue. Hey, can I go to Jessica's party this weekend? No. Jessica is a bad influence on you. Mom, she's fine. Actually, she's fine. Okay, so can I go? No, I, I just said no. Oh, come on. Just let me go. 
Okay, sure, honey, you can go. I think I know what my ability is now. See ya. Hi, I'd like to return the shirt I bought here. Sure, do you have the receipt? I don't, I actually lost it. Oh, yeah, no receipt, no refund. Oh, but it still has the tags on it, and I have the card that I used to pay for it. Yeah, don't care, I need the receipt, okay? Your new return policy is no receipt, no problem. So let's get that refund started, shall we? Your brother wants to play. Would you just forget about me? I have work to do. Hey, Tommy, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Wait a minute. What? Who are you? <gasps> Yesterday's ability was really weird, so let's go with purple today. Please don't be bad. <laughs> hey, Dad, I'm going to head to Jessica's party. Now, wait just a minute. Don't worry, Mom said I can go. I better let her have some fun before I break up the news about the divorce. Uh, you and Mom are getting a divorce? I didn't... Oh, no, you got mine reading today, didn't you? Sweetheart, you weren't supposed to find out like that. Good morning, Bria. Good morning, Mr. Peters. She's got such pretty eyes and a really cute butt. What a creep. Ew, there she is. I don't want to talk to her. Hi, bestie. Oh, don't bestie me. You are a fake friend. You know what? Take your friendship bracelet back. Ow! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you in your face. Come here. <gasps> I can't believe she broke my freaking elbow. What are you looking at, Daryl? I don't care that you broke your elbow. Oh. Now that my elbow's finally healed, I'm going with green today. <laughs> well, what is that? Wait, can I control time? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Why are you packing a suitcase? I'm moving out, honey, remember? Yeah, the divorce. You know, this whole thing isn't right. I know you still care about mom. You just need to show her a little more. Now, before I unpause him, I'm going to give him this to hold for mom. Perfect. Daniel, who prepared this dinner? Dad did. I did? I, I mean, uh, yeah. Oh, baby, this is really romantic. Okay, I don't need to see this. You ready for the talent show? Wait, that was today? Don't tell me you forgot. Of course not. <laughs> Taught myself how to play this in one hour, so let's hope it goes well. She's really good. Who are those guys? Uh, those are the mark checkers. What? Didn't you read the pamphlet? <gasps> there was a pamphlet? Max Michaela Brown. That's me. No, 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 wait. I can't let this happen. If they find out that I have a blue mark, they're going to force me into some sort of arranged marriage. And what if the guy's a jerk? I got to get out of here. Crap, the freaking makeup's melting off. Hey, what are you doing? Why are you out here? Hi, um, I was just going over there because they told me that I'm all clear to go. Who told you that? Um, that was Frank. Frank told me that. There's no one named Frank that works here. Damn, I knew I should have went with John. She's a blue. Get her. Hey, you really thought you could cover up your mark with makeup? Well, actually, it was my friend's idea, but... Quiet. That was a rhetorical question. Now, we're going to have to do something so you don't escape again. What is that thing? What is that thing? This is a microchip implant. Hmm? It's only gonna take a second. Oh no, I'm not good with needles, so... You'll be fine. Hold her arm down. No, please. There you go, see? All done. You just injected me with... Uh... Don't tell me she's gonna pass out. Oh, come on. It's time to get up. We need to get you ready for the prince. What? Yes, he's here, and you can't meet him looking like that. Says who? Says anyone with eyes. Now get up. Come on, let's go. All right, she's all done. Good. You know, for someone with a royal status, you guys sure do treat me like crap. Says the girl wearing a diamond necklace. Besides, you're not royalty just yet. Yeah, so if I were you, I would lose the little attitude, okay? Because your mark doesn't become effective till the prince falls in love with you. And what if he doesn't? Hmm, I don't know if I should tell you. We're gonna go Quite get the all. prince, so you, well you better stay so put. <laughs> what? No, it's just, it's kind of funny. It's not like I can really get away, because, you know, there's a tracker in my wrist. I bet this guy is so stuck up and so conceited. I mean, how dare they, really, pair me with some super hot guy. Hi, <laughs> I'm Justine. You're not quite what I was expecting. Oh, well, um, you aren't exactly what I was expecting either, but, you know, in a good way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, same. 
You know, this whole system is pretty messed up. I know. Tell me about it, right? I mean, do they put a tracker in your wrist, too? Yep, they did. But I have a plan to escape these guys and get both of us our freedom. Hmm, you do. Well, okay. I'm listening. Guys, I have fallen in love with her. Yeah, we're ready to get married. We just have a few minor requests about the wedding. Oh my gosh, of course, princess. Whatever you want. We thought you might say that. How did you get them to leave us alone? I told them I had a little surprise for you. But why would they need to leave us for... Oh, that kind of surprise. <laughs> it's time to take your track route, so hold still. Fine, but from a scale from 1 to 10, how bad is it going <laughs> to... Are you okay? We thought we heard screaming. Yeah, I'm fine. Things were just getting a little rough in here. Oh, <laughs> well, your wedding is ready. Okay. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Wait. I... I have a confession to make. I... I'm pregnant. And he's not the father. What? I can't believe this. Well, it's too late. We're already married now, which makes me the princess, and what I say goes. And right now, I order all of you to leave us alone. You heard her, guys. Everyone out. I order all of you to leave us alone. You heard her, guys. Everyone out. I can't believe that worked. You did great. Now we just gotta blend in with the crowd. Okay, and then what do we do after that? Then we get the hell out of here, and then we enjoy our freedom. Come on, let's go. What are you waiting for? Uh, Justine, I'm really sorry about this. What? Hands near now. You're under arrest. You really shouldn't have lied to us. I don't understand. They found out my plan, Justine. It was either me going to prison or you. Mm-hmm. And guess who he chose? I'm sorry. Get on your knees. We need to check you for weapons. Where are we going? We're taking you to stay with the other reject princesses. Other princesses? Yeah. You're not the only one the princess screwed over. Now come on, let's go. Girls love fresh meat. <laughs> Keep walking. Please don't leave me in here. It's not fair. Why does the prince get to go free? He was the one who planned this whole thing. We made a deal with the prince. What can I say? Life isn't fair. Hello. Let me tell you the truth about the prince. So you're telling me the prince has been doing this for years? Yes, they let him trick innocent girls like us, just for fun. But why would they do that? Because they want to stay in power. The whole blue mark is a lie. But why? Because they don't care about us. They are wicked. Why don't we give the new girl a haircut? No, please wait. What if I told you I could help you get revenge on the prince? We've already tried that. There's no way out of here. Well, how did you get those scissors? I found them on the floor when they took me out to use the restroom. They let you out to use the bathroom? Yeah, but they have a guard come with you. I barely snuck these in. I think I might have an idea on how to get us out of here, ladies. I think I might have an idea on how to get us out of here, ladies. You sure they don't know you have those scissors? Yeah, otherwise they'd try and take them away. Well then, which one of you guys is the most violent? Definitely Greta. I have lots of pent-up anger for the prince. Greta, I think it's time you release that anger. I have to use the bathroom. Oh, I need to go too. No, one person at a time. Oh, but please, I really need to go. Get back. I said what? That was for locking me in this hellhole. Oh, shit. We We made it. We're free. I wouldn't be so sure about that. Well, speak of the devil. Greta, do you still have those scissors? I have them right here. Good. You know what to do with them. What are you talking about? I would start running if I were you. W wait, wait a minute. Ladies, let's get them. I got my mark. Let me see. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, what? It's blue. Blue? But what is... You have to cover that up. <laughs> but what is it... Cover it up. Okay, okay, jeesh. Do you think this is good enough? I can still kind of see it. No, nah, you're good. No one's going to notice. Okay. Oh my gosh, did you hear? Some people are getting blue marks. Blue? <laughs> Oof, so weird. Um, excuse me? Blue is royalty. Say what now? You didn't know that? Well, I kind of feel sorry for the blue mark people. Wait, Why? Well, apparently, the guy and the girl have some sort of arranged marriage. That is not fair. Oop, it's time for the mark check. Better hope yours appears soon, because here they come. Uh, who's they? Mommy, what are you looking at? Uh, nothing, honey. Well, what's a sugar daddy? It's a candy. <laughs> well, then I wish for a sugar daddy. No! Oh, why did you do that? Look, guys, it's sugar daddy, girl. Shut up. I was six, okay? At least I won't have to worry about money. You did not just say that. I bet she's looking forward to it. 
Mom, are you sure there's no way for me to change my wish? Your wish is permanent, honey. I'm sorry. I can't help feeling like this is all my fault. That's because it kind of is. What was that? Nothing. Love you, Mom. <laughs> Here's your test back. Can I see you after class, please? Mr. Smith, if this is about my grade and my test, I... No, no, it's not about that. And, uh, please, call me Darren. Darren, I mean, uh, Mr. Smith, I mean... What are you doing? Well, this might come as a bit of a shock to you, but I actually really like you, Brina, as more than just a student. In fact, I really don't even need this job. I just teach here so I can see you. What? Yeah, I'm actually a multimillionaire, and I'm looking for someone like you to spoil. Um, I... Please, Brina, just think about it. All I would ask for is one favor in return. Mom, I think my wish just came. Honey, I don't feel good. Call an ambulance. What's going on with her, doctor? Your mother needs a kidney transplant, but her insurance does not cover it. Well, how much does the surgery cost? 145000 out of pocket. Do it. I'll cover the expenses. Are you sure? Hey, Brina, did you change your mind? Yes, I'll do you a favor, but no one can know about this, okay? Of course, of course. Now, what did you want in return? $145,000. How much did your teacher give you? 145 k to cover the surgery. Rena, are you kidding me? I know it sounds bad, but he just wanted to take me out to dinner, and he said all he wants to do is pay for my meal and just talk. Are you insane? There's no way on earth I'm letting my baby girl go meet up with some creep. He's 40 years old and you're still a minor. I know, but they said your insurance isn't going to cover your surgery. I was trying to save you. Listen to me. I will take money out of my savings. Mom, you will go broke. I don't care. Hi, now so you go give that teacher his money back right more. now. No daughter of mine is going to have a sugar daddy. But Mom... I said no. Hey, you're early. Actually, I'm not going out to dinner with you after all. What? Why? I told my mom and she... You told your mom? Yeah, so listen, here's your check back. No! This wasn't a part of our deal. Hey, you're coming with me. Wait here. I'll be right back. I have to get out of here. Wait. He's an idiot. He didn't even take my phone. All right, I'm back. Here, I bought this for you. Put it on. Yeah, that's not happening. Please put it on, Brina. I'd like you to wear that. Oh, so now you want to be nice. You know what? Can I ask you something? Honestly, why are you so obsessed with me out of all the other students? Because you... You remind me of my wife when she was younger. She passed away right after we got married. Ever since then, I haven't really been the same. Whoa, now I almost feel bad for doing this to you. Doing what? It's all clear, guys. Police, let me see your hands. Oh. I'm so happy you're okay. Yeah, I just don't get it, though. I wish for a sugar daddy, not for a creepy stalker teacher. Well, honey, look what came for you in the mail today. Wait, so it is a candy? <laughs> yep, and after I sue that teacher, we'll have plenty of money to pay for my surgery. Happy birthday, sweet. Only one? He's so innocent. I love him. Two at once? It's okay. It's okay. I am not judging not three at once when we finally meet him and i are gonna have to have a little chat about this one my soulmate's body count is six i mean it's not that bad it could be worse that's horrible absolutely crazy is that crazy how much is your soulmate's body count zero um zero calm down guys it's 2021. There's nothing wrong with being a little promiscuous. Their body count isn't how many they've been with, it's how many they've killed. What? I can't believe it. I can't believe my soulmate is a killer. Calm down. Just breathe. You'll probably never even have to meet him. You know, it's honestly offensive that the universe thinks I belong with somebody like that. Let's get our mind off things. Let's watch TV. Breaking news, the Cheerios Bandit is on the loose. What kind of name is that? The Cheerios Bandit? He already has over 10 bodies. Could that be him? Your soulmate? I, I need some fresh air. I think I'm gonna throw up. There's no way. There's no way the Cheerios Bandit could be my soulmate. Who are you? Come with me. It's time for the big reveal. What did I get? You got gold. Gold? <gasps> I knew it. 
I was born for fame. Okay, show me yours. What did I get? You got gold too. Oh my god, we are so lucky. Girl, did you hear they're looking for a girl with a pink mark? They say she's the long lost princess. What? <laughs> no way. The prince is also giving a pink mark. There's only two people within the whole kingdom with a pink mark. You know, gold never really suit me, but marrying a prince sure will. Hello, sir. I'm here to see the prince. Nobody sees the prince. Yeah, okay. Oh, ma'am, I'm so sorry. Please come with me right away. <laughs> of course. You're so beautiful, just as I expected. <laughs> I mean, me too. You're, you're handsome, I mean, not beautiful. Well, you are beautiful, but... <laughs> I get what you mean. Well, you better get home and rest. Our wedding's tomorrow. Yeah, you're right. I now pronounce you Prince and Prince. Wait, she's a liar. Emily? Who's that? That's Emily. She's my best friend. Her mark is fake. She's not the real princess. I am. But Emily, your mark was gold. I covered it because I was scared of being royalty. But I can't sit back and watch you lie any longer. Is, is this true? I... Both of you are coming with me till we figure this out. No! Wait! Ready for the ghoul school? Yes, and I think my creature name is about to appear, but I already know it's gonna say vampire. Actually, darling- Dad, that's the bus. I gotta go. I don't want to be late. Welcome to class. Today we'll be learning about the rarest type of creature. Does anyone know what it is? Is it the rarest one a mermaid? No, dear. It's a fairy. But aren't fairies extinct? No, legend says there's only two left in the whole world. That is why all creatures here must get a DNA check. What would happen if one of the students here was a fairy? They would be taken for experimentation, but we've never found a fairy before. <laughs> Next in line. Hmm, your facial structure is very unique. Okay, open for the DNA test. We need your DNA. Wait, I... I feel sick. You look fine. No, really, I feel like I could just... Ugh, throw up at any second. Okay, you can have a pass for today. But you'll have to get the DNA check tomorrow. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Thanks. Dad, you've got some explaining to do. My creature name just appeared and it says fairy. Oh, darling, I knew this day would come. So I'm not a vampire like you? Well, no, you're not. I knew it! You told me my things weren't coming in because I was a late bloomer, but I knew there was another reason. So I guess this means you're not actually my dad. No, I adopted you. Well, apparently fairies are the most rarest creature. Please tell me you didn't take the DNA test. No, I didn't. I told them that I was feeling sick, but they said I have to take it tomorrow. This is very... <gasps> what? Darling, look! <gasps> what do I do? Well, a fairies can control their wings. Try to make them disappear. Are they gone? Oh, yes, they're gone. Darling, you must control your wings at school. But I don't know if I can. You have to, or they will take you away for experimentation. There you are. It's time for the DNA check. I'm still not feeling well. You have to take it. I should really be getting to class. You can't go to class until you take the test. Hold still. We're taking a hair sample instead. Ow. See, that wasn't so bad. We'll have your results shortly. Go to class. Hey, Luna. Oh, hey, Gloria. What's the matter? You seem really sad. I'm a little bit worried about something. Oh, well, you can trust me. What's bothering you? Well, attention, students. Will Luna Black please come to the front office? You guys wanted to see me? We got your DNA results. We need you to come with us. What? Take her away, boys. No. You really thought you could hide from us. Let me see your arm. This won't hurt a bit. Since you're one of the last fairies, we need to do research on your blood. Uh, don't be such a baby. Doctor, I think you may have taken too much blood. Let me see. She still has a pulse. She's fine. We need the pixie dust from her blood. Time to wake up. I feel really weak. That's because all your pixie dust is now in this necklace. You'll be dead soon. What? Yes, I'm afraid we've drained all your power. And fairies can't survive without their pixie dust. I'm sorry, dear, I can't hear you. <laughs> Dad? Luna, I had a feeling they would take you. It will be okay. I'm going to get you out of here. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You are the reason there's no more fairies left in this school. Wait! Oh. Quickly, take off that necklace. Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna, quickly, take off that necklace. 
Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna? No. Please work. Darling, are you alright? Yes, thank you. Of course, darling. I will always protect you. I'm sorry I'm not your real dad. Even though we might not be related by blood, you're always gonna be my dad. Oh, darling, thank you. I love you so much, Luna. I love you too. Well, I think it's time we leave this place. I know somewhere safe we can hide away and live. Red alert! What do we do? Well, we both have wings. Oh, yeah. Let's fly. Come on, let's go. This is my daughter. Hi. Oh, hello. And how much time do you have left to talk? I have two hours left. Perfect. I've been dying to get to know my future stepdaughter. And that's how I met your daddy. Wow, that was a really long story. I know, and I haven't even let you talk. Go on, it's your turn. Well, I like to play. Oh, no. Are you all out of talking time? Well, there's always tomorrow. Mm. Ten minutes? Are you kidding me? And so I regret this is running. Hey, Ingrid, my dad wanted me to... Yes, the best thing is he's built the bridge. <laughs> no, he didn't suspect a thing. <gasps> How long were you standing there for? You little gold digger. I'm telling my dad. Dad, you won't believe what I just heard Ingrid saying. I told you to get her. The breakfast is getting cold. Don't forget about our breakfast, okay? Ingrid is a... A what, Anne? Spit it out. Oh boy, you're out of talking time, aren't you? Did I hear Anne is all out of speaking time? Yeah, poor thing barely got to talk at all today. Wait, Anne, just text me what you want to say. What's the matter? Don't tell me you forgot to charge your phone again. You're kidding me. Anne, that's not really responsible behavior. I agree. But hey, I gotta go to work, so text me once you charge your phone. Hello, Anne. I'm really sorry, but I can't let you do that. Don't worry, I'll keep it safe. Why didn't you text me? Dad, she took my iPhone and my iPad. You did? Oh, would you look at that? She found another way to communicate. And yes, I did, because I caught her watching some inappropriate videos. Anne, is that true? She won't admit it, darling, but I did catch her, and she really needs some discipline. <gasps> oh! Anne, that's it. You're grounded. Get out of here. Ingrid, I'm so sorry. This behavior is not like her. Don't worry about it, darling. I think I do know where you can make it up to me, though. <laughs> Let's start by getting that shirt off of you. Yes! Oh my gosh, she is so busted. Dad, guess what? I got five hours of talking time today. You better be using that time to apologize to Ingrid. No, Dad, there's something that I need to tell you. No, first eat your breakfast. You have plenty of time to talk. Okay, I finished my food. Can I please talk to you now? Okay, but thank Ingrid for the breakfast. Wait, she made this? Yes, even after you were so disrespectful to her. So I want an apology to her first, and then we'll talk. No, Dad, wait. <laughs> Don't give me that little laugh. I have five hours of talking time, so my dad is going to find out exactly what you... Exactly what you... Are you okay, Anne? Uh, there you go. Now just rest, darling. You sure she's all right? Yes, I think it's just a bad flu bug. Don't worry, I'll watch over her while you're at work. Oh, thank goodness you're up. Dad? Yeah, hey, how are you feeling? What time is it? It's 4 p.m. You were asleep for almost the whole day. Luckily, Ingrid watched over you. Ingrid? Ingrid did this to me. She... Oh, you're all out of talking time. Oh, you want your phone? Well, sweetheart, Ingrid accidentally broke it. But don't worry, I'm going to get you a new one. Also, don't freak out, but we moved our wedding date up to next weekend. Look, I know this is a lot to take in, but the venue that we wanted had an opening, and we just had to take this opportunity. All right, this time, no messing around. Dad, Ingrid is a liar, and you won't believe what she's hiding from you. Sweetheart, I think I know what you're talking about. You do? Yep, she told me the news this morning. Yes, darling, I told him I'm pregnant. What? I'm so happy for us, Ingrid. Anne's always talking about how she wanted a little sibling. This isn't over, Ingrid. Really? Because I think it is. Face it, darling, I have your daddy wrapped around my little finger. And if you cause any more trouble, I'll convince him to ship you up to boarding school. <laughs> Here, Anne, take out the trash. 
Your daddy and I are going golfing. <sighs> Seriously? Wait a minute, is this her pregnancy test? That little liar, she's not even pregnant. Oh, it's time to expose her, but what better time to do that than her wedding day? Oh, this is ridiculous. What's the matter? I only got three hours of talking time. Oh, I'm sure that won't be a problem. Listen here, you little brat. If you do anything today to ruin my wedding, you'll regret it. I'm almost out of talking time. What if I can't say I do? Ingrid, it's gonna be okay. Yeah, and if you can't talk, you can always just nod. That'll work just fine. Yeah, exactly. Darling, could I speak to Anne alone for a moment? I know you're planning to ruin my wedding. I can sense it. Oh, Ingrid, I would never do such a thing. Then why do you seem so damn happy? Because I know that you're not really pregnant. Oh, I see. So you're going to try and expose me? Well, do you really think your daddy will believe you? Yes, I do, because I have proof. Really? Well, would it happen to be on this phone? How did you? Oh, my God, it's hard for the wedding. Coming, darling. Now, why don't you just fetch? No! Oh, thank goodness it's not broken. Here, this is your future pill. Future pill? Yeah, it tells you what your future career will be. Gold digger? But that's not even a career. I need a new pill. Can't. Everyone only gets one. Hey, did you take your future career pill? <laughs> no way, you got gold digger? Shh, we don't need to draw attention to it. Everyone look, Brianna's future career is a gold digger. <laughs> Stay away from her, boys. All right, everyone, you can partner up for these math worksheets. Hey, Derek, can you help me? I don't understand anything. No, don't talk to me. You just want to take my money. What money? Did you take your future pill yet? No, I haven't taken it yet. I have it right here. I'll take it when we get back from the assembly. Good idea. Let's go. No way. So cool. I'm going to be a mafia boss. Well, if I'm going to be a mafia boss, I better start dressing the part. Someone stole my future pill. Now I'm going to have no future. Hey, look at the... Ah! Since when are you going to be a mafia boss? I'm scared. Now that I'm gonna be a mafia boss, no one will mess with me. Sorry. Hey, watch where you're going. Please don't hurt me. Bree, how is it possible that your future career will change? You only get one pill. Don't know, and I don't care. Can't believe it. Someone stole my future pill, and now I don't get a future. I'm gonna be jobless. I know who stole your future career pill. It was Brianna. Her future career all of a sudden just changed. I got you the new dolly you wanted. Thank you, I love- Stop. You can't ever say I love Y-O-U. If you say it to someone who's not your soulmate, you'll lose all memory of the person you said it to. Hey, baby, I got you lunch. Aw, oh, thank you, babe. You're amazing. I think it's time for us to say the L word. But Evan, what if you're not my soulmate? I don't want to forget you. It's okay. You don't need to forget me. I'll just say it then. I love you. Evan? Um, who are you? How do you know my name? I'm your girlfriend. I don't even know you. You're not my girlfriend, you bitch. Hey, Emily. Evan told me he loved me today. Brianna, that's great. He forgot me. Oh, no. I need to make him fall for me again. Even if we're not soulmates, I don't want to lose him. Emily? Evan? Emily, how could you kiss Evan? I love him. And I? Brianna, don't say it. I love you. Emily, how could you kiss Evan? I love him. And I? Brianna, don't say it. No, Brianna. Brianna. Hmm? How do you know my name? Uh, I'm not sure, but my name's Emily. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hey, Brianna, I really like your sweater. It's so cute. Thank you. It's new. I just bought it. My ex just came. He told me he loved me today and then forgot me. Whatever. Don't worry about him. You deserve so much better. Thanks, but how would you know? You don't even know me. I don't have to know you. It's obvious. Did you see? Evan was looking at you the whole class. Whatever. He lost his chance. Hey, Emily? Yeah? I never forgot you. What? I never forgot you.
Happy birthday, sweetie. Thanks, Mom. What'd you get me? Here. Skittles? They give you special abilities. Yeah, whatever. Magical powers. Well, I guess I could try one. I don't feel any different. Bye, Mom. I'm going to school. Wait, honey, I have some bad news. Your grandma passed away. Oh. Well, that sucks. Wait, you're not sad? No. Why should I be? Bye, Mom. Oh, no, that's horrible. What's horrible? Jessica got hit by a car. Oh, my gosh, for real? Well, I'm sorry for her. What's wrong with you? Hey, baby. We have to break up. I hooked up with Emily. Oh. Well, that's okay. What do you mean, that's okay? Was it good? Was what good? The hookup. Was it good? I knew you never loved me. Let me try another one. Ooh, purple. My favorite. I wonder what this is gonna do. Good morning, Mom. Hey, honey. I wonder if she knows that she's adopted. Wait, I'm adopted? Yes, I'm sorry, honey. How did you find out? No, it's okay. I'm going to school. Hey, Giselle. Oh, hey, Olivia. I had so much fun hooking up with her boyfriend last night. Wait, you hooked up with Lucas? How do you know that? It's fine. I've always been taught to give my all toys to the less fortunate. Well done, Giselle. You got an A-plus on your test. Oh, thank you, Mr. Bates. She can definitely get an A-plus on me. Can I transfer out of this class? Ugh, Giselle, come on, just go on a date with me. Tyler, you ask me every day, and every day I tell you no. Fine, I'll just watch you by your window again tonight. I have to remind myself to close my blinds. I'll try another color. Orange? Let's go see what this one does. Hey, Mom. I never loved you. I regret having you and your sister is my favorite child. I don't know why I said that. It's okay. I'm leaving for school. Well, that was freaky. Hey, Jess. I'm only friends with you because you have a hot dad. Wait, you're only friends with me because I have a hot dad? Yes, I don't like you. You're a shitty person. Good to know. Hey, psst, Giselle. What's up? Doesn't Mr. Fitz look so hot? I want to marry him and have his babies. Did you just admit to being in love with our math teacher? I don't know how much more of this I can take. Hey, babe, I've been meaning to tell you I'm in love with your mother, we're getting married, and I'm going to be your stepfather. I'm going crazy. What's the next color? Green? So good. Let's go find out what this one does. Hey, Mom. I still can't believe you failed your math test. I wish you would just forget about that. Forget about what? My math mark? What math mark? Never mind. I'm going to school. No way. Does this power make my wishes come true? Hey, Giselle. Hey, I wish you would give me your hat. Oh my gosh, yes, take it. Thanks. Giselle, you failed your math test again. Sir, I wish you would just give me an A+. Actually, you got an A+. Hey, Jackson. Hey, Giselle. I wish you would go on a date with me tonight. Well, keep wishing, because it's not going to happen. Wait, what? Do you think I'm dumb? Which color should we try next? Let's do yellow. Pause and play. I wonder what that does. Hey, Mom. Giselle, why didn't you do the dishes last night like I told... I guess I could do the dishes quickly. I told you to. What do you mean, Mom? I did them last night. Go check. Oh, I'm sorry. I must have been confused. I'm going to school. Okay, class, get ready for a pop quiz. Pop quiz? Well, I definitely don't feel like doing that. Wait, where'd Giselle go? That's one way to get out of it. Ugh, this class is so boring. Why isn't it pausing? Could you stop that? I'm trying to listen to the material. Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo? Marco? Safe. Emily, I'm so glad I found you, sissy. I was so scared. It was so dark. Marco! Polo! <laughs> you actually fell for it. 
Bestie, don't scare me like that. Chill, I was just joking. It's serious. My little sister Emily was chosen to play the game this morning. She almost didn't find me in time. <laughs> What's wrong with Cynthia? Her boyfriend died during the game of Marco Polo. He wasn't able to find her in time. That's awful. Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Polo. Marco. Marco. Polo. Marco! Polo! Thank goodness you found me! I'm so glad you weren't far. Choose who will play. They're making me choose? Well, I can't choose my mother. Marco? Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo? Polo! Bestie, why can't I hear you? Polo! Marco! Polo! Failure. <laughs> Choose. You're making me choose again? Oh. You're up early. Unfortunately. Honey, I need a favor. Can what the? You drive your sister to school to... Day. Hey, when did you change your clothes? Get back here. This is a robbery. What? First thing in the morning? Give me your car keys now. Ah! Oh. <coughs> oh. Uh Brianna, you're late. You'll only have 10 minutes left to write the test. Don't worry. Just hand me the test. I got this. Come on. We've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? Come on. We've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? How are you not paused, but everybody else is? I don't know why, but I have the same ability as you. I can pause time. We must be the chosen ones. I'm sorry, but this is real life, not Star Wars. Wait a minute. So if you press pause, it stops time not only for you, but for me too? This restaurant you brought me is amazing. You know I know how to treat a lady. Let's kiss. Why aren't you breathing? James! Okay, I can't wait any longer. I'm leaving. Hey, can I ask you something? Sure, what? Well, I just think you're super fine and- Brianna, hurry up and unpause it before I lose my riz. Um, I'm not paused. What? Okay, what do you choose? Uh, I choose snow, cause I want to be just like mommy. Aw, good choice, honey. Don't you worry, I'll teach you how to use your powers. Mom. Please don't leave me. Take this, honey, so that a part of me will always be with you. Alicia, meet your new stepmom, Greta. What a pleasure it is to meet- Oh! My hand! I'm so sorry, I- I didn't mean to. My hand, it's blue! Go to your room. Is she going to be okay? She has frostbite, but it's mild. Are those the gloves I gave you? Good. Keep them on until you can get your powers under control. Darling, she could have killed me. I am so sorry. Her powers, they've been going haywire ever since her mother passed. Well, she is a danger to all of us. She should be locked in that room. No, I couldn't do that to her. Don't you care about me? Greta, of course I do. Then it's settled. She won't ever leave that room. Here's your breakfast, princess. Aw, oh, thank you. <gasps> you took off your gloves? Uh, yeah, just for a second, though. Oh my gosh. Uh, stay back. I'm gonna leave the food right here. Wait! Hey, Alicia, can I come in? I don't know. Can you? Because it doesn't seem like anyone else is allowed in here. I'm sorry, but I can't have you hurting people with your powers. I won't. I can control them now. Okay, then. Make a single snowflake. Just one? Uh-huh. Like how your mother used to. See? It's all right. You can't do it. But I can learn. I know you will. But until then, you have to stay in here. Dad, please. Put your gloves back on, all right? I'll be back to check on you later. If no one's even allowed near me, what's the point of wearing these anyways? I have to get out of here. Here's your lunch, princess. <gasps> hey! Guards, stop her! She froze my feet to the floor! Put your gloves back on, princess. 
So you guys can keep me locked in here? I don't think so. Hey! Stop her! I made it. I'm... I'm free. But where will I go? Mom always said that I could create anything that I imagined, so why don't I just make a place for myself to live? Stop it. You got this. It's working! Whoa, I can't believe I made this place. I mean, it's not exactly perfect, but it'll do. I just feel like I'm gonna get a little bit lonely in here, so maybe I can make myself some sort of a pet. I've always wanted a dog. Oh, I think I'll call you Snowball. Well, well. Greta, what are you doing here? I'm here to bring you home. This is my home now. I think it's time I showed you my little secret. You have powers? Yes, I was a princess after all. Guess which one I chose? Why don't I just show you? you I'm not surprised. He never sends me anything. Hey guys, my soulmate just sent me $200. Well, while mine sent 10000 10000 That's crazy. How much did yours send? You didn't send me anything. Wow, must suck to be you. Whatever. You wanna come shopping with us after school? Oh wait, she can't cause she's poor. At least I'm not money hungry like you guys. You're just saying that cause you're jealous. I guess the least you could do is send me thin butt so I could get my nails done. What? Girl, I have something to tell you, but you can't tell anyone. What is it? My soulmate just sent me one million dollars. I think I know who it is. I think I know who it is. Girl, spit it out. You know that famous singer Alex? Yeah. He said in an interview that he sent his soulmate one million. Please, there's no way. It makes perfect sense. No, it's probably just a coincidence. Paige is out, guess what? If this is about my soulmate, you can stop. He's playing a concert here tonight. We have to go. You're not gonna let this go, are you? You know me too well. Fine, if I go, will you shut up about it? If you go, I'll never say a word about it again. Fine, I'll go. Okay, we're here. Now what? Ladies and gents, before the concert starts, I would just like to donate two million dollars to my soulmate. Are you here? Yeah. My amount just went up. Ladies and gents, before the concert starts, I would just like to donate two million to my soulmate. Olivia? Yeah? My amount just went up. See, I told you it's him. I knew it. Well, what do we do now? We have to see him after the concert, of course. How are we going to do that? We don't have the passes. Just leave that to me. Let's go. Hi, ladies. Can I help you? Um, yes. We would like to see Alex. Can I please see your VIP passes? We don't have any. Excuse me, sir. I know Alex personally. Why, of course. Right this way. I can't believe he just got us in. One of my many talents. He's coming. Well, go talk to him. Good evening, miss. Would you like an autograph? Actually, no. I think you might be my soulmate. What? And why is that? Good evening, miss. Would you like an autograph? Actually, no. I think you might be my soulmate. What? Why is that? Well, when you donated two million to your soulmate, my amount went up. And how many did you have in your account prior? One million. Then it's definitely possible. Come with me. Where even are we? We're going to check if we're soulmates. Put your hand on the scanner. Okay. Mine says soulmate found. Mine does too. Wait, we're getting something else. There's another match. Wait, what does that mean? That means you have two soulmates. This is ridiculous. You can only have one soulmate, not two. Well, that's what the system says. Alex, this is not the time to be sending me money. I didn't send you anything. What? I do have to. I'm ready for school. What's this? I'm ready for school. What just happened? What about this one? When did 
I get here? Chill, we've been here an hour. An hour? I never even left my house. You're acting strange. And that is why the war started. Dude, did she just? Bro, no way, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> you have zero manners. No, no, it was the chair. It was the chair, I promise you it was the chair. No way, that wasn't a chair. We all heard it. Get me out of here. And that is why- Miss, I need to use the bathroom. Hey. <gasps> Babe! I'm here to break up with you. Also, I've been cheating on you throughout the entire relationship. I'm really sorry, but I'm not actually. Oh, you are not getting away with this. Hey. Babe! I'm, I'm breaking up with you, and I've been cheating on you throughout this entire relationship. How could you do that? How could you cheat on me? Oh, just like how you cheated on me this whole relationship? I, uh, how did you know this? I'm an intellectual. You will never believe what I can do. I can go back and forth in time. Have you lost your mind? No, I'll show you. I want to take my best friend forward in time. Bessie, did it work? Did what work? Family. I can't live with this guilt. I have to fix this. Okay. I'll help you. Thank you. Take my hand. What is taking her so long? It worked. I convinced them all to stay home today. That's great. Let's go back. Wait, I forgot my phone. What's going on? Wait, come back. No, I left her in the past. <gasps> Pesky, there you are. I was so worried. Who are you? Finally 18, what gift do I get? A mystery box? Oof, well, might as well open it. No, don't. Why? I heard a story of one person who had a mystery box and they stopped breathing right as they opened it. I should wait to open it then. Good idea, it could be 